So would this save Outriders? Would this bring players back to play or would it just add another layer grind people just don't feel is worth doing? That's what we talk about today. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders be sure to subscribe. So I'm making this video right now with the thought processor that many people actually watching this video have either stopped playing, don't play as much as they used to or just waiting on new content for Outriders. So I will explain what's going on for the people out there who don't have a clue here. So over the past month or so, maybe a little longer, many people have speculated about extra levels being added into Outriders. For instance, weapons and armor raising to a level 52, your character level raising to a 32, and this being on the basis of the great revival of the game. I personally have spoke about this actually not too long ago when we saw a dude on reddit post about he himself logging in one day to find he had a weird level to his character which was believed to be based on gear score as a total this was determined by him on this same character having certain loot over a level 50 and when this higher level loot was switched out to lower level gear that character score dropped switched back it raised not only this though over the past few days we have seen further things which suggest extra levels might be coming a video posted by Cloud Play shows someone having a level 32 character as well as level 52 weapons. I can't show the images of said levels myself as Cloud got strike for doing that very thing, so I'm staying clear of that. But let me reassure you they were legit images. We also saw via data mined images before this game's official release which showcased armor and weapons being at level 52. Now before we go any further, none of what has just been mentioned proves any such levels are being added into the game. Right now we don't know what's happening at all, but I do want to talk about what I feel extra levels to Outriders would indeed do for the game. So right now, our character classes are at a level 30. Adding two additional levels would no doubt mean adding two extra skill tree points. Now what could you achieve with an extra couple of points which would impact your build? Me personally, I feel two extra points would make a great difference for some builds I've tried in the past but couldn't quite reach a level with them which made them efficient enough. Two extra points would no doubt change that for the better. In terms of gear, weapons and armor it means we would no doubt be more powerful and have a higher armor stat. But it also adds another level of grind to the game. I mean yes you can level items up with those drop pod resources, but at a max of 1 million or 999,999, this number wouldn't be enough to level everything we have up. In fact we wouldn't even know what it costs to level an item up from a 50 to a 51 and then to a 52. No doubt though over 100,000 resources for sure. I'd also like to think they would add in two extra challenge tier levels to the expeditions at the same time for a place to use said gear we obtain or level up. Now in terms of what these extra challenge tiers could offer, the options here are limitless in reality. We could have dedicated loot with rotating loot pools with these two extra tiers, we could have some kind of challenge mods to them, we could have reduced times, more enemies, etc etc. The possibilities are endless here. I wouldn't mind also seeing the addition of a few extra mods for us to chase, that would indeed be great. Now I'm keeping it minimal with things I'd like to see here as I truly don't feel such changes would take too much work. I mean yes, I'd love to see DLCs with new character classes, more expeditions, 50 new legendaries and 2 plus hours of additional story, but something like that I don't feel is coming anytime soon. But the addition of extra levels wouldn't be too hard to incorporate in my opinion and it's more likely to come sooner than later. But what do you feel about this? What would additional levels do to you in terms of where you are at with Outriders right now? Would it bring you back if you've stopped playing? Let me know down below. And yes guys, I've realised these changes would need to come after any fix the game needs or still needs. Let's not push those to the side. Now, I'm really just making this video as it seems the videos and images I'm seeing of loot dropping above a level 50 seems to be more apparent by the day. These could be like most of us are thinking are modded items and they probably are but even still the room by circulation of extra levels being added into Outriders is definitely a possibility and it's an interesting topic. I personally feel additional levels would be good for the game. Yes they won't bring everybody back but I feel they will spring a little bit of life back into the game for sure. I feel right now Outriders of the game many many people want to be good and would give it another chance if certain features were added but we will see guys. But let me know your opinions on this down below in that comments section. 
And on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I'll see you on that next one.